Okay, well, that's a little bit funny. Is that the trailer we just delivered? Oh, well, now that one's a uh, fragile. That's quite a bit farther of a drive. There's a lot of twists and turns in there, but that would take us through two towns that we have not got yet. So I guess this will be a longer drive. Six hour trip. We are going to have to stop and rest because it's already 4.30. So this might turn into two into two episodes. We're going to have to swing through the town so we can get, claim it. It's acting like it is our trailer that we just delivered. So that it is right here. We'll have to back up. That one. Yeah, it is. I swear it must be the trailer we just delivered. They reloaded it. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Yeah, so they backed it in, unloaded it, reloaded it, and now I'm grabbing it, put taking it even farther south. Southwest. tight to that curve. We have to try to get out here as far as we can so we don't take out that fire hydrant. screenshot with the with the other trailer as the screenshot for this drive because so I took two if you didn't see the last episode I took two screenshots during that one so I guess I'll use this use one of them for this video and one for the last video it's the same trailer it's the same configuration not the same Maybe the same load, but I'm trying to get a drink of water. I'm sorry. Woo! I got choo -choo -choo. <laughs>
how the drive goes. run this is the time of the year where you save money on fuel oil and electricity yike okay took that corner just a little too fast city or whatever that is on there because I can't pronounce it and I'm just gonna I don't really want to butcher it <laughs> so I'm not even gonna say anything well that's why you might notice that like you know some of the games like I've never been good at pronunciation and sounding out words and stuff it was always because I did dyslexia and it makes it really hard so if I can't like pronounce a name, I might just substitute it with one I know <laughs> with a name that might be close to what it looks like it's spelled like.
lot of real tight corners and stuff on this route.
is one of the towns I have not been to yet. I was kind of afraid that I was going to be on a freeway and I was going to have to like exit just to to get to it. I guess we could stop, put some gas. Say, well, I don't know, if, maybe not. I don't know. Gas is kind of a tight corner. I guess we could try it. We got to get back here anyways to park. our trailer gets through this narrow section. I'm not good at backing up a regular trailer, let alone trying to do double. cab real quick and see what what we're dealing with As I think we're last trailer is caught on something first trailer out. Yeah, see, this, the last one is caught. So I'm going to have to try to... Oh, boy. I'm going to have to try to reverse it to get that one unhooked also. I'm 
watching the trailer. <laughs> okay, we're stopping right here. <laughs> we're sleeping. <laughs> oh, I don't want to decouple. Okay. Sleep. Oof. <laughs> I thought I was stuck. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's continue. percent damage on that trailer. Why does it look like it's got us going back? Because we were heading that way, I thought. Take a look at the map real quick. Oh yes, I don't want to go that way. That's just going to make us turn around and come back. That's weird. Why are they sending me that way? Because that's just turning us completely around.
police Mustang or something like that, and it sounded like a semi truck. They didn't have a Mustang engine sound or a car engine sound to put with it, so it was a, a six cylinder Mustang with the 12 cylinder Cummings engine or something. <laughs> the online a lot with just, you know, where the only other cars on the road or the trucks on the road are um, other players. Played that for a long time until I did start having issues with people just not, like, caring or play. They I had people that would, like, purposely do head-ons with you as you're going on the highway and I was trying to keep a good record and they would just come whip right in front of you head on it's like okay that was the last time I played last time somebody purposely did that I don't know if they wanted to log off or something and they didn't really care the rest of the session or what but Sucks the fun out of it. It's like a school. It's one thing I don't really remember seeing too much. Looks like a school, I don't know if it actually is. Like a little 
sharp corners. 35 mile an hour spin limit, three or not a, for the corner, not a hard thing to hit. Remember once we start going downhill, then it's probably gonna be the opposite. We're gonna have to be riding the brakes. That's pretty cool. Yeah, 
gonna say I set it at 35 and it's kind of the engine braking for me that's what I would like to be able to do in game pull off at any of these spots and kind of get out of the truck and go into like a first person mode not through Photoshop, not the not the photo mode, but just like a first person, or even a third person. You know, you can see your little guy, you know, go over to the side rail and look around. And they could have some animals walking around down there, like an elk or something like that. Would be kind of cool. out there trying to ruin your day. <laughs> Oh, now he's going 
fast. I'm gonna try to get around him, but his truck's faster than mine with his load compared to mine. It'd be cool to come across one of my other trucks on the road. But I think I got most of my other people stationed in other you know, like other states in the south or in the northwest. trucks are on the road in one day in the United States across the whole country gotta be a lot of them because we're you know moving all that merchandise from store to from manufacture to distribution to, to the store level and then for deliveries and mail and things like that Interesting to know. Is it in the millions? Is it a million of them? Or is it a hundred thousand? No, there's probably there's definitely more than ten thousand trucks on the road in one day. Excellent. 
fragile cargo. Still got the, even though I did damage the trailer, but it was only like 2% damage, so they still gave me the fragile cargo long distance bonus. Nice. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching this episode. I really appreciate it. Hope you have a great rest of your day, and I will talk to you in the comments.